guys, today I have a new Toy Capsule Lab video for you, and I think I added some new capsules over the past few weeks. I haven't done one of these in a while, so I am just going to close my eyes and grab a few out. So, one, two, three, how about a big one? Four, let's do six, why not? So I'm going to grab these two. Let's start with this one. I already know what it is, actually. It is the little bottle Pantsu, and Pantsu is Japanese for underwear. So I think this is one of the weirdest things that they have. But it's a little pair of underpants, and you can put it, let me show you, on your water bottle. And it's supposed to keep your water bottle from sweating from the condensation. Isn't that funny? Let me go find a water bottle. Ta-da! So yes, Weird Japan is weird but still cute at the same time. Next, let's open one of the small ones. And, oh, it's Stitch. It is a little Stitch figure. Oh, he's so cute. Look at him, he looks confused. I love Stitch with droopy ears, he's adorable. So this is a whole series of little Stitch figures and they are all so cute. That one's my favorite so far. Oh, this one's taped up really well. What is this one? I think I saw a cat. Oh, it's called Anakara Animaru. Animals coming out of holes. Definitely a cat. Look at that, though. It's so cute. Uh, imagine lining up, like, all of them on your desk, though, and they're just popping up out of the ground. In the photo here, they kind of have it shown in a planter. That would be super cute to put this in with your plant and have it popping out. Okay, I want to do that, except I can't keep plants alive, so maybe not. Maybe a fake plant. Next, why is this one coming open? It's another cat. So actually, lately, I have been getting a lot of animal gotchas because there are a lot of cute ones out. What is this? It is Konnichinyasu smartphone stand. I do not remember getting this. So apparently you can stick this to the back of your phone. Oh, it has a little suction cup. And, oh wow, that is a chubby cat. Look at that. So it sticks to your phone, and if that were a flat surface, it would lean like that. Well, that's interesting. Chubby cat, you can hold up my phone, I guess. I just kind of want to put this on the window, you know? It looks like a hybrid of a hamster and a cat. So chubs. Let's see what's in this one. I can kind of see a figure. I don't remember getting this one either. I get these gacha bones and I let them sit in there for so long. Why can't I open this? What is this? Oh, I think I remember. I think I got this at the toy show and it's from an app. Puzzles and Dragons? I don't know. I might be wrong, but... It is a little dragon, I would say. It has little wings, tail, and it's winking. Okay, last one. This one looks like an animal as well. Is this taped down? It is. It looks like this is one of the chi chibi chubby shiba inus. That is adorable. So, this was an animal kind of day. It's so funny because... I guess they're all lumped together even though I mix them up. So here is the white Shiba. He has a little collar on. This is a character, I believe. I see him in the game center a lot with the plushes. So this one's called Byong. So he's stretching out Byong. So this was an episode for you animal lovers. We have chubby dog, chubby cat, and cat popping out of a hole in the ground. I approve. I definitely approve. And then a dragon. And a stitchy! And I am confused about these, but they are cute. I don't know if I will put them on my water bottle, but I accept. I don't know what I accept. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed, and I will be back hopefully next week with another Toy Capsule Lab video. If you guys have any requests, let me know. And let me know what you think of the bottle pantsu. See you next time. Bye!